Hi guys, um, thanks for joining us this evening. Um, I thought we'd just bring you a little bit of an update on day two. I've also been posting stuff all day on our Facebook and kent999.co.uk. So we're just out and about at the moment. Um, just been hit a massive bit of snow down here towards Rockham. Slowly descend down this hill. So it's a lot worse tonight than it was, I would say, last night. Despite the fact that the roads, the gritters, I know people are giving the gritters a hard time. The gritters, guys, have been out and about, we've seen them out and about we can bounce for them but I know one guy that's been doing the 249 he's been going up and down up and down up and down all night on a 12 14 hour shift so we're just down at Wotham at the moment so we'll just keep this going um the 20 is just covered in snow as well so despite the fact we know highways have been out pushing stuff on pushing grip but like they said grit only works when cars are cars are out there pushing this grit into the road and that's how grit works we're off on heath at the moment we're gonna very very heavy snow up there at the top of the top of the hill I know West Kingstown always gets it. So we'll have a look up this way because Swan Lee's normally we go up we go up onto the 20 this way and then we'll do a flip around up there at the I think it sort of stops at Dartford and then Somebody in front of us braving the conditions. I think it's going to be a one hell of a long night for the Kent RPU. And the gritters as well. I know the, the South East 4x4 volunteers are out and about. Bluebell Hill still remains closed, impassable. There is a proper ice rink up there, despite the fact it being gritted. I think it's just one of those areas that's. situation out on the M20 at the moment um, despite the fact that the cigarette has sort of spreaded and if you are out and about but you've got to, you've got to concern yourself with your steering so obviously you stop every so often and get rid of that snow that you're picking up that's what affects your steering and that's what that's how you lose control you know take it nice and easy that's what we've been doing so this is more towards Dartford side so we're, we're going to go back down the other way because that's where the snow seems to be coming Wapham, West King's down we won't have a shore room quite bad over there a lot of the country roads and the little villages 
Kim's have been out scraping and doing her own snow ploughing but there's any children in the room but obviously it's, it's adult time only now so like I said I'm not gonna have this this rubbish on this channel if there's any children come to tuck you in normally we're just coming into this bit what I call the I was joking with somebody the other day every time we seem to go up here at night into London for to cover scenes and stuff like that because there's one section between Wensheim one side and blowing a hoop this part is always thick, horrible fog and everything else. And, and driving through this this morning was absolutely hilarious because it was sunshine everywhere else as well. So just go back down this way and we're going to have a flick around. We'll come, we'll come back up in a sec on this. I know there's a lot of you watching, and there's a lot of you interested in this and the weather and, and what's going on. So we're going to pick this up for a minute and then we'll be back up when we get back down into some snow. 